Oh man, like, yeah. Yeah, it's the, uh, the, the mess sucks. Damn, don't look like a woman. What, what's a woman supposed to look like, Lacey? <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. You son of, I'm in. All right, hold on, man. Let me, uh, the stream's being all gross. Let me push a few buttons, turn a few knobs. There we go. There we go. That looks better. Good even. How do you spell evening? I-N-G. Evening. There we go. Hey, everyone. Welcome. It is Monday night. We are starting our new stream schedule. I'm Nick. Thanks for being here. Hey, Nate. I look ridiculous, like, in-game, or just like me? Either one. <laughs> yeah, like, Lacey was just making fun of this armor. She said, how can you even tell if you're a woman? I'm like, I don't know, what are women supposed to look like, Lacey? <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks for popping in, man. Yeah, we're gonna, for this week, we're gonna stream, uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 6, and see how that goes. Uh, yeah, I had my first day of being a stay-at-home, uh, mom today. Got to hang out with the little one. <laughs> Stay at home dad. And then, uh, yeah, while we're waiting for people... <laughs> Thanks, man. While we're uh, waiting for people to roll on in, uh, got a new follower, Omni Lacrono. So thank you very much for the follow. Hope you enjoy your stay. Uh, yeah, and I think that's about it. Yeah, new times for streaming for a little while. I'm still going to put everything up on uh, YouTube, so if you can't catch this live, you can always catch it uh, there. I look beautiful in real life. Oh, thank you. All right. So, we are doing all the new quests from the Creation Club. Uh, the one we've got loaded up now is Defeat Umbra, which would require us running all the way back across the map, and I actually don't know if I can beat Umbra. That's right here, that Champion's Rest. So I think instead we're going to head over to McCarth. And I know that there's some new quests in there. Yeah, it's my favorite city in the whole wide world. Uh, I did a little uh, inventory management while you guys uh, are off screen before the stream. So we got our, down to 100, less than 100 pounds. Yeah, and then uh, my buddy uh, Nate, the look at its cakes. My mod, he's been uh, playing a little bit of Skyrim, been, I think, enjoying it, right? Man, it's fine. I was gonna, I was gonna move you guys, but you're fine. I don't need to read. There's nothing I need down in the bottom right hand corner. Oh, that toy! <laughs> it's fun to summon demons. <laughs> It is fun to plot against the government. <laughs> so yeah, all right, let's get cruising. So I think we could just pretty much follow the road there. And I think we're not going to pop into any mines or anything. I, I want to get to the uh, new quests. And if we can't get one in uh, McCarth, there's another one in Solitude. There's one at uh, Dragon's Reach we can get. Look how fat! Look how far I can run, Nate. I mean, not me. Old broke Bertha. Yeah, I hope we. Yeah, did I buy, yeah, we have a. Uh, I made like eight million garlic breads <laughs> in the last stream. That was like the most diseases I've seen in Skyrim on somebody. I was like, man, what do you think? They could probably give you like a couple. I, a package, I just left the house, game. I just left the house here. The game is just like our baby. Like, oh, are you currently not eating right now? Then you're probably hungry. If you're not eating, then you probably should be eating. You have so much stamina. Oh yeah, look how far I can run. 
Oh man. Who needs a horse when you can be your own horse? Uh I think it's this way. Uh, hell if I know. Uh alright. Hun, which way should I go? That way? Or that way? My target is like right there, like exactly the middle. <laughs> Probably the bridge. You're right. Lacey's so smart. Stop it. Stop it now. Oh, shit. A shrine. Hold on. Uh, let's see if these ones cost money. Of course they do. Oh, yes. And if you guys are new to watching this, uh, this is a no money challenge. So I can't buy anything. I can't spend money. I can't have money. Uh, I don't use it. Don't believe in it. So we are trying to be completely self-sufficient. Which means, uh, we, on top of the survival mode we're doing, we can't fast travel at all. But thankfully, there are tons of new quests because of Creation Club, and so we've just been popping around uh, doing all those. Uh, pardon? Yeah. Uh, we're a two handed heavy armor. I figured that'd be the most, like, Self-sufficient. Um, I'm gonna try to. Hey, everyone! Thanks for popping in. Yeah, it's the. Uh, it's part of my new uh, stream schedule. Lacey had to go back to work. Welcome, by the way. Good to see you. Yeah, I think this is the latest I've ever streamed. <laughs> oh, tricked me. Too. There we go. Yeah, so Lacey's went back to work. Oh, there's my decapitation. And so, uh, yeah, I'm watching the kiddo during the day. Do I need any of this stuff? Probably not. And so, yeah, so I can't stream because I gotta, you know, make sure she doesn't, like, get, eat a pencil or something. Back to work, yep, she's, uh, she's back at it. She had syllabus day today. <sighs> yeah, and I'm trying to not get it any, get like too distracted if we're heading. Ooh, a mine though. That's tempting. Let my stamina fill up so I can run for another like three minutes. Back to work. Back to work. I oh, know. Oh, Nate, I am having absolute D&D &D withdrawals, no matter what we're playing on Sunday. I don't care if you guys get Ebola. What? What's happening Sunday? Like, just, uh, I that's, that's a joke. Ask her how many emails she deleted without reading them. How many emails did you delete without reading them? Uh, she said she went through 700, but she didn't answer my question. She said she can't. Th she said she can't count that high. Like 80% of them were just like instant deletes. She said. That sounds about right. All right, let me grab because we can always use those. Um, should we use the cheater chest? I mean, we've made it this far without cheating. We might as well not. Let's pi let's let's look inside. I do kind of need some grand soul gems. <gasps> oh yeah, did you guys see Thistle? Where are you at? You at? There he goes. Bye, Thistle. That's my rabbit. Hi, Thistle. Get your ass over here. Come with me. It's my rabbit. Alright, oh, you're so great. Alright, get the hell out of here. Go find an ingredient? Wait for me at home. Uh, Hendraheim. I forgot that I own a plantation. 
is a strange sight. Yeah, I would have deleted. I just would have deleted makes all of them. That sometimes fall from the sky. I would have. I would have looked at a single one. I said, "New year, new email address." <laughs> Deleting everything. Should be like right here. Yeah, I thought it's like right in here. There it is. Oh man, looks good. Oh, I kind of want these fish maps. Oh, I'm not fishing yet. Don't need the gold. I will. I'm gonna take these. And then other. What's a cagote? What, can we eat this? Okay, let's just eat that. Oh, those are from uh, Morrowind. Cagouties? Cagouties? I think those are from Morrowind. Hey, cure disease. I'm taking that. Uh, if we read this, it could start the quest. Uh, I mean, we ain't nerds. Let's take those drugs. <laughs> oh, the, uh, the cheater chest? Uh, so... Uh, because of how yeah. the wandering merchants work in this game, the Kaji, uh, they have an invisible chest that they keep their inventory in. It's because they don't have a shop. And they have never patched it out of this game. Like, they've never bothered with fixing it. So if you know where to look, you can pop inside and get their uh, inventory and just steal it. But I'm not a dirty thief and cheater, so I'm not going to do that. <laughs> oh, I miss taking the horse. If it was free, I could take it. Alright, Makarth. Idiot city. Bethesda doesn't do patching, that's for mod creators. Yeah, they're, uh, they're the crockpot of of companies. They just set it and forget it. It's good enough when you put all the ingredients in. <laughs> Bit of jewelry for your journey home. Oh, look, you walk oh, into the city, the first thing that happens, someone dies. Great city. Board. And then this guy's gonna be like, you dropped this. Okay. Is this true for all of them? Like, uh, the one near Whiterun? Uh, yeah, but their inventory space isn't there. Slash... Uh, it's at, uh, Solitude, MacArth, and, uh, Dawnstar, I believe. On in. The Silverblood yeah. Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. I, the one at Solitude is super hard to find, but the Dawnstar one and the MacArth one are really you easy. You a fighting gal? What's this guy's name? Cosnatch? Cosnatch. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm not? going to get that. another drink. What can I do yeah, for dude. you? Get a drink. I know somewhere in here someone will start me a quest. Why can't the men in this city leave me alone? I'm what you'd call a soldier of fortune. Make me an offer. Oh, you man. Change your mind. Unfortunate. Out here. Watch your back. Yeah, man. You better get nothing but you this money. is the All Silver Blood Inn. Water. I'll let you figure out who owns it. Here, yeah, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Uh, that's not. That's oh yeah, that's empty. that's just. Uh, Have you seen that shrine of Azura? They say the dark elves built it after they fled from Morrowind. Like I want to Sight steal to shit. See. Yeah, I mean it's a good way to get a lot of like money, a lot of soul gems. Uh, well, this Remember, guy ain't the guy. Hey. It's cheaper than blood in Mark. Either of those. Uh, so maybe no this guy break. is. The, how about a bet? I'm drunk, and it's been a while since I had a good fight. A hundred seconds oh. as I can take you. Bare hand. Yeah, yeah, we got him. Hey, okay, so Nate, I think I knew what was going on when you were doing this. And you would, remember, you'd be brawling that lady, and then she would just be like, oh, she'd pull out her weapon and, like, start slicing you up. Uh, I think you were wearing gauntlets that do extra damage, and the game calculates that as weapon damage, not unarmed damage. Yeah, this, yeah, this city sucks. <laughs> But yeah, I think that's hey, what was I happening. I may have had a few, but I can still count. You don't have a hundred septums on you. 
<laughs> it's very Bye. true. I have, I have about zero. All right, so um, is it you? Now you just tell me if you need something. What was that you said? You that come was twice right? that I can work out a little more about magic. Got no good use for that here. Mages keep to their college in Winterhold. Go bother them. Wish the Jarl's wizard would up and leave with ya. Depends. Are you thirsty, hungry? What's on the menu? Depends is on the menu? That's Nothing, gross. You pig headed oaf. Probably my dear loving wife. Could you please clean out our guest rooms? Oh, here it is. There it is. The rooms yourself, Clapper. All right, it's look for like the knight's ghost in the area here. south of Macarth. All right, so let's read this. So we can actually figure out what the hell's going on in this quest. Okay. I found a book at the Silver Blood Inn that mentions a ghost of a Breton knight uh, named Simon Rodain. According to the book, he haunts the river below his tomb south of Macarth. I should investigate the area and see where I can find. Bingo. We found it. What an old bitch. <laughs> you talking about me? I got feelings, Nate. Um, all these, I'm not going to be able to sleep in this place for free. That would kind of ruin it. Let's get out of here. But we could, we could take a little nappy poo. A woman attacked right on the street. Are you all right? Did you see what happened? Yeah, I, I, I must you have missed have it. Sorry. sorry. I just hope the eight bring us more peace in the future. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Nope. 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 I'd better get going. City ain't none of my business. <laughs> I've gotten everything done here that I'll ever need to. <laughs> You're not even that old. I'm. I turn a uh, 38 this year. 38. Yeah, 47, 38. It's about this. Yeah, it's about the same. I'm not going to live to be 47. This is more. Oh, is it cold? Is it like the dead of night? Yeah, it's Take like a little past midnight. I'm going to get chilly. It's a little cold out here. I'm a little peckish. I'm tired. <laughs> I don't have any money. <laughs> oh, I guess I do have this book. Should be a good. All right, how many pages is this thing? Okay, so here we go. Up, oh, no. Dude. Unfortunate. Um, the mines. Okay, these are bunk houses. Blood. What happened to you, Pop? Trolls. Blood. No, it's not a bunkhouse. Skaggy's house. Get some rest. I'll send word to the yard. Thank the divines we survived. How come the miners' barracks is closed? Those forsworn were fierce fighters, fiercer than I could have imagined. Eh, yeah, we'll be fine. Don't what is being school. tired doesn't do anything. It's like for magic or something. We don't use. It. We don't believe in that witchcraft. Oh, it's for the potions too. It makes your potions worse. Our ladies are some lucky women. I tell Lacey that every day. I should start telling Brittany that too. You guys know how lucky you are. God. Can't trust this game. Oh, Nate, have you found a uh, have you found a house yet? Did your playthrough? Have you have you gotten one? All right, so it's a it's a tomb, and he haunts the river. Is that him? Rip your heart Why don't I ever have my weapon? Oh, because I'm summoning the rabbit. <laughs> Completely worth it. Oh. 
What do I have? I, I probably have two, like, two-handed damage or something like that. Or, like, oh, there it is. Two-handed attacks do 8% more. Probably the 8% for now. When you, like, increase your stats by a percentage, every percentage that you get, like, beyond that is worth more than the last. Corpse note. Corpse note. Corpse note. <clears throat> Corpse Note. If you're reading this, then I'm most likely dead. I mean, it's called Corpse Note. Oh, uh, haven't got a house? Uh, the one outside, I think, uh, the one I'm at, is Hendraheim, like, you just go and kill that lady, and you can have that one. And that's, uh, that's the house that's right here. And that's, like, I don't know, where's Falkreath? Right here. So, you just follow the road up. It's, like, halfway between... And right here is another house, too, that's free. You just have to kind of do a quest with it. This house is free. And... This house... Uh, has a quest tied to it. And I died twice uh, with a regular character trying to do this. So yeah, hey, welcome, everyone. Come on in. We are just getting started on a new quest called... Not quick save. Crypt of the Heart. Oh yeah, the corpse note. Alright, ahem. If you're reading this, then I am most likely dead. A group of bandits ransacked my home and took most everything valuable I own. The worst is, they took a pendant that has been in my family for generations. Most of my family is dead, so that pendant was the last connection I had with any of them. I am going after those scoundrels and getting my pendant back, even if it's the death of me. Alright, well... Okay. Well, that's a, a bummer. <laughs> and so now we've got to be on the lookout for a ghost. Oh, shit. Should we try talking to him, or should we just... Uh, goodbye. Oh. Uh, no, not nothing over here, dude. Uh, yeah. Oh. Uh, I thought he was was gonna talk. I might knew some murdering near White Run. The one near White Run is uh, that one costs money. Yeah, I don't think you can murder anyone for that house. Did I just get a disease? If I just got a disease, I'm gonna throw my controller through the floor. Oh, thank you. Little baby Jesus. What's this? That's like an orc place. Are we steering clear of that? Yeah, we're steering clear of the orcs. A little fighting going on over there. Hope they figure it out. Yeah, go, uh... Go pop uh, and get the che that cheater chest. And, uh, I'll show you... Uh, after this, I'll show you... I'll, uh, I'll show you where the other one is and done. Donstar. Did you kill this rabbit? Over here. <laughs> Ouch, that hurt like hell. And smash. Alright, search the shaman. Let's check these other two out. Let's get this Briar Heart. Burning? We we already have both these enchantments, I'm pretty sure, so let's leave them. And I've been taking these. Mostly so I can have something valuable, I guess, to make me feel like I'm not completely off my rocker. Alright. 
read the shaman note. Ahem. <laughs> uh, what's this one called? Oh, that one. All right. Um, get out of the way. <laughs> get out of the way. We've killed the traitor and given the knight's heart to the mother. She's gone back to Karthspire to perform the ritual. Uh, we'll stand watch until she returns and drain the blood of any knights who interfere. I mean, we kind of look like a knight, like a dwarven knight. All right, hold on. This is messing with my chi. All right, so Karth Spire. All right, it's a ways away. And it, okay, I guess I don't need to. Are you the knight? Knight of the Crypt? Your armor is so cool. Uh, yeah, this this armor is sick. Alright, first things first. Let's see what we're actually supposed to be doing. Spell Knight. We don't cast that many spells. Uh, Knight Captain's Orders. <laughs> I've never seen that armor before. Uh, we received port reports that the Beldama Witches have resurfaced in the Reach. I'm calling upon all willing and able knights to cleanse the land of witches, hags, and Reachmen. Oh, God. Uh, remember always the death of our sworn brother, Simon Rodane, for the Order of the Crypt, and for all of Shornhelm, Captain, uh, Knight Captain Renor. Alright, well, that's the guy that we read about. And, what are, oh, are you another Spell Knight? Iron Spell Knight. So this stuff's worse than... This one. Is it like the light armor version and the heavy armor version? No, it's just steel and a little worse. Better. Better. I will. If anything, we'll put it on the. Uh... Is, it, is this your is this your grave? Take that armor, dude. Uh, isn't using anymore? Absolutely. That's for us now. Alright, Shrine of Mara, you're gonna cost me a hundred bucks. Who, like, is she just, like, up there being like, oh, I would give you a blessing, like, sitting on her cloud or whatever, be like, I didn't hear them <laughs> coins jingling. Alright. So, obviously, we're going to that place. But... Oh, we could... Much, like, that stuff doesn't weigh that much, actually. It's got to, right? 35, 8, 4, 5. So it's like 45-ish pounds. 50. Yeah, oh well. Because right, I think that's it right there. Yeah, we are a little bit tired. No, that's a that's an orc place. They're not gonna let us in. We can go murder them all, but we can find a bed. We'll find a bed. Somebody will take us in. Look at us. Oh, I dropped my pickaxe, didn't I? Yeah. Because they weigh like ten pounds. Heckish, huh? Can at least fix that. Have some potato soup. Reach Wind Airy. I bet you this is a free house. Or not a, a free house, but I bet you this is a creation club house. I think this is a cre creation club house. Take that ridiculous armor I'm wearing off. It's uh, it's all enchanted though, so it, do it makes me uh, do extra damage with my weapons and stuff. So I can't take it off until I get new enchantments. Alright, so let me double check. But yeah, I want to get out of this. Okay, let's see what it looks like, though. Let's see what it looks like on us. Oh, we look dope.
I know, I know, guys, I know. All right, let's, uh... Let's see what's in here. I think this is a free house. I think this is a house. I mean, it's technically a house. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. so far so good. A little bloody, but so far, this book in uh, is in Morrowind. It's part of the main quest of the game, I believe. I think eighty percent sure about that. Ah, oh, I don't want that soul gem. Oh man, look at that gold diamond necklace that I can't have. Uh, sure. Let's take the, take the zombie scroll. Take a silver helmet. Armor rating 44. That seems good. 47. Alright. Uh, dwarven plate. This place is kind of a Kind of a dump. I thought this was a. I thought this was gonna be a house. This is a nothing. Expert. All right. Wait, hold on. Aren't I like worse at this? Because <laughs> I'm tired. Oh, no, no, I'm fine. That's if I'm, like, cold. Oh, oh, that was easy. The rest way. Easy, easy. All this is garbage. <laughs> ah, all right, well, did it for fun. No, I didn't see a, uh, I didn't see a bed in here. Unless we could, like, sleep under the table. Yeah, this place was kind of a... Right, hold on, maybe the secret is to sit down. Uh -huh. It's not the secret. Bed? Bench. Bench. Oh, if I'm cold, it pick locks worse. Okay. Look at you, you're like the Skyrim Pro now, man. You don't need me anymore. All right, let's. Ooh. Okay, we got this. Uh. You never have to take points in cushioning because you can always just climb down. Let's teach this bear a lesson. <laughs> I mean, this is how I get diseases. It's like, oh, oh, he like he went through some mitosis. It's just split. I don't think I'm gonna pick up the bear stuff, especially if I'm already gonna be full of uh, that spell knight armor. Like, it looks so good. It's not even, like, over the top or anything like that, either. It's just, like, it just looks like cool armor. Like, almost, like, believable, realistic-looking armor. Like, I'm not, like, an armor pro or anything like that. But, you know, like, you get into, like, World of Warcraft and your, like, pauldrons are, like, up over your head. Like, that kind of stuff. The women's armor just has their, like, tits hanging out, like... What's that gonna protect? Not protecting your decency. It looks like there's either a hunter camp or a like some sort of camp up here. Let's go check. Let's go check out who's. What the hell? Yeah. These guys camping on a. Oh, it's right down here. Oh my god, there's so many. Wait, is this 
this just Hearth Spider right here? Woo! Oh yeah, Card Spire is a huge place. Oh man, that kind of hurt. Yeah, they want to follow us in. Yeah, this place is, I forgot the Card Spire is like a gigantic ass place. I still do want to sleep before we go down there. We can pop in there, though. Hey, hey asshole. Can't hide from me. Oh, man, I'm being pincushioned, though. But they, th they say we're low on stamina. What they don't know... That I got a bunch of. Is it in potions? I get it's a kind of a potion. Drugs. All right, let's go. <laughs> Drugs. Man, I am one shot. I, I am doing like extra damage. Lots of it. <laughs> That's what's so great about the game. You can completely be ridiculous when no one ever know it. I gotta save. Oh yeah, probably right. Who's fireballing me? Oh, they're all, like over here. All right, hold on. Let's heal up. Get out, old Slappy. Pop down our little halfway through this fight save. Have a quick read. <laughs> Level up our block. All right now. All right. Holy shit! I think I had like a resist fire oh, potion too. You. What? You guys aren't even full sword. Oh, they're, they're like quest witches. Oh, that means they're gonna hit hard. Oh no! <laughs> Get out of here! I hate. The uh, hag ravens. I'm warning you. Back off. I'm warning you. I'm warning you. Not gonna I'm warn you nine of ten more times. That's close enough. All right, we'll read that after. Oh no, I fell. <laughs> Stairs, man. Wait, are these guys really just like not aggroed onto me until I run up and? All right, let's just go around. It's Put away that ridiculous shield. There we go. Alright. Yeah, next is getting a little warmer. Alright. I think I thought at first we had to go inside. But I think it's right around the corner here. Sure. Sure. Just eat a bunch of tomatoes I find in a barrel. Um oh, we're gonna need steel. To upgrade. Can I even make this stuff? Nope. To upgrade our uh, shit. The steel uh, spell knight armor that we just got. Uh, yeah, stealing it, stealing it, stealing it, stealing it. Yeah. You know you want to hoard it. I yeah, dude. I I can't stop. I've got a sickness. I'm ill. <laughs> Flowers? Good enough? Ah, well, one more. You can't ever get fully, fully rested sleeping outside. Unless you're like, I think one of the races you can. I forget which one. Like, I think Kaji and like, 
the Argonians can eat raw meat and not get food poisoning. That was like the first thing I did when we got to... Oh yeah, I got the witch note. Food book. Uh... Velma witch note. There we go. Ahem. We have stalked our sister De Den Denella? Denella? Yeah, Denella. Uh, for years. Reading the feathers and bones. For not even a witch of Beldama can escape the eye of the coven. Using the crow's sight, we found her upon an altar in the reach. Time and... Time and age did little to fool us. She is one who betrayed us to the knights. Such an act deserves a cruel death, but simply killing the traitor will not be enough to ward mother's vengeance. We will corrupt her beloved's heart and return it tainted, damning his soul for eternity. She will know this as he dies upon the rock. That's pretty effed up. But I mean, that's a good way to, like, get to somebody. Like, oh, if you don't think it's, like, getting to them is gonna work, you just go after the people they love. You didn't hear this from me, though. Uh, it's super lightweight, too. Oh, man. Do I even bother, like, looking around this place? What am I really gonna find? Grapes? Wait, I think maybe. Alright, let's, let's just go get this quest. There's some Nern root. I hear ringing at me. Alright, somebody's heart is corrupted and we gotta go smash it out of them. Oh, it's already... No, Alright. Uh, corrupted... Oh, it looks a little... Looks a little off. Uh, purify the heart at the altar? Uh, everybody. Agraven feathers. How do I, uh, purify the heart at the altar? Which altar? Oh. Oh, God. Alright. So we're done here, is what it looks like. Oh, Dwarven Shield of Waning Frost. Oh, I wish I could. Wish I could. Ooh. Uh, attunes the caster to fire, equipping the Ember Bolt spell for 15 seconds. It deals, so this turns you into like a fire machine. Uh, and I don't need this. Yeah. Pass on that grass. <laughs> Take all that. Take all that. I think I could probably make like a health potion. Oh, nope, two. Alright. Actually, let's warm up right over here. I am going to grab myself a beer. Since it's nighttime, I can do that and not feel weird. Have it be in 10 in the morning and drink it in front of you guys. Uh, I said I'm, I said I'm having a beer, but I'm actually having a Coors Light. That's all we got. <sighs> we had the uh, Elysian like IPA sampler pack, and we like tore through that in a day between Lacey and I. All right, so it looks like we don't have to go inside Cart Spire at all, which is cool. I thought about, I would have turned around and went right, straight in there. All right, so back to the altar. We'll have to purify the heart, unless we wanted to like corrupt it for some reason. But I mean, we're not evil. And honestly, that kind of shit just ends up backfiring. <laughs> Called it a wee bit dramatic. A wee bit dramatic. But, you know, to each their own. I hope this is the right way. I think it is. It looks like that's got to be right. Look at it. It's even got its own little path. It's got to be. Mountain climbing, mountain climbing. Where are you? 
where in the hell did he even come from? I was like looking that direction. I might be blind, y'all. Alright, top me off. Because the natural health regen in, in survival mode is a little weird. Alright, and so there's that weird dwarven like tower. That must be part of a quest that I don't know about yet. Like that thing was just seemed very Like not like worthless, but like not worth the effort of putting it in the game, you know what I mean? Like why is it there? Oh, a little early. And yeah. Give me that. Give me that to it. All right. Here's our little uh, where we we're following our ghost friend. He was like a little orcish camion thing. Wait, where's the altar? Oh, we came up this way Half before. Outlander. By the code of Malakath, this stronghold belongs to the orcs. Your kind that's are fine. unwelcome. Well, that's either racist or sex sexist. We won't kill you, Outlander, but we don't want you here. Remember that. I mean... I'm not entirely convinced when you said we won't kill you, Outlander. Like, I mean, not, like, you know, our character. Like, we're way too strong for them. But, like, just some average, like, little Joe Schmo walking by there, and they're just going, hey, our place. And it's like, what? I was just walking by. It's like, this is for us. All right, we'll save here and make sure we do the uh, old uh, corrupting, uncorrupting of the heart, right? All right. Oh my god, am I going to have to pay a hundred bucks? Am I going to fuck this up because I'm not paying a hundred bucks? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't god. cost me any money. What the hell is this? Thalmor? I hate the Thalmor. I was just over here minding my own business. Literally just minding my own business. <laughs> Let's use the minor healings. Get the hell out of here. I wasn't doing anything. Oh, I hate the Thalmor. I wish to just mind my own business. You decide to shoot me in the butt. Alright, a couple more potions. Back to. What a bunch of jerks. I mean, we already knew that they were a bunch of jerks, but like, what a bunch of extra jerks. Alright, let's see what the the Thalmor say about us. Ahem. <laughs> uh, be on the lookout for the Nord called Bertha. Our name is Broke Bertha, first of all. She is an enemy to the Thalmor. True. And it has actively disrupted our activities and caused great harm. Have I, though? If spotted, you are to destroy her with extreme hatred. Be his advice, she's extremely dangerous, quite able to defend herself. If caught by the local authorities, we aren't able to offer you any assistance any assistance uh, for the glory of the Aldmeri Dominion. So it's not a sanctioned hit. They just want me dead because I'm so great. Alright, we'll save. And you're going to have your heart back. Oh, look. Oh. 
Oh. Uh, do I get all of this? Ebony! It's ebony! It's ebony! What? No, 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 no. Oh, the ebony? This is gonna look way cooler than the other stuff. Oh, and it's so good. Oh, the ebony looks so good. And it's already enchanted. Heavy armor, stamina, restoration spell, and magic resist by 22%. Well. Oh, we look dope. We look cool as shit. And it's ebony, too. Oh, we look cool as shit. Oh, it's so much better than the, uh, than the other stuff. So much better than that, <laughs> that, uh, Mesopotamian style, uh, like Babylonian helmet. Alright, let's run back home. I just want to put a marker. At least get me aimed in the right direction. Right on. All right, what are we looking at? Yeah, we gotta. Go. We'll run back, drop the shit off, and then probably head to Falkreath, or we can go to Solitude. If you don't pick that up, yeah, I, uh, I got smart. I got smart. I wised up. It looks so good. It's so cool. Can I just like wash down the river and then make it to my house? <laughs> yeah, and it's like it's like already enchanted too. Uh, did I miss a turn? Nah, 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 nah. Maybe, maybe. What are we looking at right here? Nah, I'll, I gotta go north and then I'll. This game. This game. What do you got going on over here? Nope. Alright. Well, you two enjoy yourself. I don't know who sides who. <laughs> help! Uh, I don't know who I'm helping. Yeah, they can follow me. Good on that. Oh yeah, we got our thing. Our restoration spells cost less now. Man, it, maybe this is the calling we needed. Now we can be like paladins. There. Are they still following me? Good job. Oh, I found some really cool armor. I'll show it to you after I'm uh, done being chased. No, uh, I, I mean, probably, yeah. Uh, not like the Seduces the same armor. All right, jackass. If you're gonna follow me all the way here, no, it's not, man. It is absolutely not the end for me. The old Coors Light. Oh yeah, you got like one. Lucky son of a bitch. Nah, I'm, I'm good, thank you. Yeah, not a not a big wine person.
Oh, cold red wine? Yeah. Weird. Hey everyone. Hello, hello. We're almost up to a thousand live views. Cumulative, not like right now. I'd be pooping my pants. Yeah, so uh, Lace and I came up with a few ideas for uh, what's going to happen once we reach certain milestones. I think we've got some good ideas. Oh, I'm peckish? I mean, it's been like a good five minutes since I've eaten. Potato soup for you. And there's a new quest in Falk Reef. I oh, excuse me, gross. We'll do that one next. <laughs> oh yeah, here, <laughs> check out this armor. Yeah, don't I look cool? A, a statue? Yeah. Oh yeah, I could, I see that. Yeah, it's designed, I think, off of like ancient Mesopotamia, or, like Babylonian cultures. But yeah, it just ends up looking really boxy. But that's all right. And there's our house. I guess we can't see it from there. It's like on the other side of that. We are a little bit tired, so our stamina is recovering a little slower. And we've been putting a decent amount of points into our stamina. It's the stamina pool's pretty big. It's way bigger now because of this armor. There's something there that uh, I think it's by like it was 70 points or something like that. All right, not that one. That's this is the way we run down. The way we run up is up here. I, I still don't know what is like the real way we're supposed to get up to our own house. Our own, our house that we legally bought and got by completely legal means. Yeah, there isn't one. All right, I'll show. You. Yeah, I'll show you after. Done. Look at this tree that lives in my house. All right, I'm not going to do a bunch of uh, inventory management while I'm here, but I am going to drop off the heaviest stuff. Yeah, that's good enough. Yeah, I, I, I'll do all that at the end of the episodes. I'm not going to make you guys watch it. And there's our horsey. Yeah, I had to move him out of the, I had to move out of the stable because he was really, really bouncing around in there. Baby can't hang? Yeah, right? She likes to stick her whole f hand in her mouth and get chew on her hand. Hey, look who it is! Hey, Thistle! Game? Oh! Alright. I love Thistle so much. Alright, so... We got the masks on those two. I don't know what to put on the bodies. But that don't matter. We'll do these. This one. Dope. Yeah, that's not look so cool. And then what? A new season of RuPaul. Wow. Are you excited? Uh, crown a winner. Order of the seasons, uh, and then we'll we'll put more dwarven shit on that one, because I think I literally have like gauntlets in here. But uh, I'll do all that stuff off camera. I know you got. Oh man. Since we're not selling anything or like having any money, uh, let me go double check if I can disenchant this necklace. And if not, I'll throw it in the. Throw it in the junk drawer. Oh, oh man, restoration spells. 
Magic resist. Well, I'm not going to disenchant either of these. Oh, our armor looks so cool. But it's going to be a while before we can improve it. It's ebony, which we don't, we can't do yet. And it's enchanted, which we can't do yet. So it's a double whammy of uh, incompetence on our end. <laughs> um, we have a fire arrow. Did somebody hit me with a fire arrow and then it didn't work? It just didn't go off. Uh, I think we're good on everything else, right? How much do we weigh? 102? Alright, yeah, let's, uh, that's good enough. Alright. Oh, yeah, sleep, duh. Duh. You say, duh, Nick. You're tired. Get some sleep. Two hours. That's all we need. That's all we can afford. Not well rested, though. Let's do one more. There we go. Well rested. All right. So there you are. <laughs> uh, Falkreath has one. Uh, we did Crypt of the Heart. We can do. That one's a little far away. We could do. Okay, there's one in Solitude, one in Falkreath, and one at Dragon's Reach. Which one should I do, hon? Uh, I'll show you on the map. Uh, you. There's a new quest down here at Falkreath. There's a new quest in Solitude. And there's a new quest in Dragon's Reach. At our house in Hendraheim. So I'm kind of like in the middle of three of them. Falkreath? Yeah. South. Alright, we slept. Let's eat something here so we don't get peckish the second we step out the door. Uh, yeah, let's just eat one of these. Well, just that easy. We're well fed, we're well rested, we're warm. What more could you want out of life? Alright, Thistle. Wait, what are you carrying? Thistle has some of my shit. Aw, oh, you can have all this, Thistle. That's all for you. Yeah, in real life, I want a bunny really bad. When I was a kid, I had, like, some, like, not, like, exotic pets, but I had, like, snakes and lizards and, like, walking sticks, so, like, different from, like, your normal pet. But nothing like two nuts. And I've had, I've had like, guinea pigs... All right, cat, cat and dog. Uh, had a rat. I didn't really have fish. My mom had birds. We had a ro we had roosters and chickens, and they were like, they would like the rooster would crow at like 5:30 in the morning every day. It was right outside my older sister's room was like where their like little coop was. And so they would just sit out there and just <laughs> scream at her all morning. <laughs> Where did that rabbit stick that aura? Uh, rabbits have a... Uh, ha Where's that guy going? Where are you going? Are you running from someone? Like, I should, should I chase this person? Cause I can could, I, I could catch him. Yeah, see? Hey. Oh, no. I'm a... Vampire fledgling! Oh, there's there's gonna be no way. I can't catch this person. I have no melee. I, I don't think I can catch this person. Or, I have no, I'm all melee. I have no range. I don't think I can catch this person. I thought that cow was a bear. Oh. Hey. Hey, giant. Hey, giant. Is this your cow? Is this your cow? Your cow? Nah, I'm not gonna tempt fate. Did I? Oh man, I went the wrong way. All right, south. Hey, hon, we get a chance. You might grab me another Coors Light, another beer. Yeah, they're up here. 
Yeah, I should probably stick some more sodas up here too. We're all out of the Dr. Peppers. Uh, we had Diet Dr. Peppers up here, but we ran out, so I, I want to bring some. Yeah, just a few of them. But I'll do that tomorrow. So now I get to, like, use my days. I'm like, okay, like, what can I do around the house just to, like, get things done? But I have the baby, so I kind of, like, take her with me to, like, different areas. And there's, like, little different, like, baby stations that I have that I can set her down and be like, okay, you can't move if I put you here. Okay, you can't move if I put you here. Yeah, still, still good. Pretty sure I can follow this all the way to Falkreath. How much stamina do I actually literally have? 230, that's pretty good. Now with that attitude, that's true. That's true. Whether you can or you can't, then you're right. Sometimes. Uh, when it, you could buy your own house and you had to buy lumber for your house, I always bought from this, these people because they were uh, always up at night because they're uh, vampires. Don't tell anyone though because they're incredibly convenient. Isn't this one of the areas with the wild horses, Nate? I know you uh, you bought a bunch of the wild horse maps or whatever. On the road, yeah. Yeah. Well, hello everyone. Welcome, welcome. Should be fine if you leave her alone for a couple hours. The rabbit, yeah. The rabbit's in charge of the house while I'm gone. That rabbit can do whatever it wants. All right, there's Falkyrie. And then in here we should start a quest. It's kind of a throwback quest to uh, Morrowind. And it's, I think it's a quest, well, if I remember it correctly, where the reward's going to be like, Oh, thank you? <laughs> oh man, I wish we had better beers. Oh well. Oh well. Alright, the Valkyrie... This city's it's got a big old graveyard. Uh, it's got a it's got a daedric quest in there if you want to start one of those. There's a murder cult that lives right outside. Oh, daughter? Oh, I thought you meant the rabbit. Uh, I mean, she could she could be in charge of something too, I suppose. Ah, she like, if you aren't staring right at her, she gets pissed. Did you see a dog out there? Yeah, I've seen lots of dogs. Uh, some wool. No. I've seen whole packs of dogs. Yeah. This was a specific one. The blacksmith is offering a reward for a dog he saw on the road. I was hoping you'd seen it. I guess I'll stay on the lookout. Keep your nose clean while you're here, outsider. Keep your nose clean. Will do. With my big old nose, it's too hard to keep clean. Alright, I'm not doing that Daedric quest, because that's not a new one. Turn that off too. But I am gonna do. Oh, I wonder who I talked to in this. I talked a lot. I think I, t I think I just talked to the Yarl. It's either well it's either I go to the Yarl or I go to the inn. That's Everything usually where right. you go to if you want to get quests, right? The uh, one of the inns or the Jarl. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> oh, thank you. Uh, this guy's gonna want to sell me a house, though. Yes. Too. What is it that you want? Ah, is it's you. One? Yes. Well, now we'll see if the stories about you are true. There's a group of bandits in my home. I can that outdrink I anyone. May have had a few discreet dealings with. The cut uh, they were giving me was good at first. But now, now it's time to clean things up. Go and take care of it. Ah, uh, please. Good. Uh, I don't 
I think these Execute are every them. Last bandit, All right, do you have? No one. All right, not talking to the, that goober. Yeah. Boogie boogie. No, no one. Is this bed owned? Yeah, of course it is. Oh, maybe that guy. Uh, I don't know. Oh, this guy looks like he's gonna. Oh, lady? Sorry. I'm the Nenya? steward here. Nenya business? I serve under Jarl's... Sid Gear can sometimes act too quickly, but he does... The Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Oh, Here, this is a general this quest. This is like a repeating quest. Yeah. Kill the bandit leader. The kill the giant. That kind of stuff. We don't do those. Path. We don't do those. I protect the Jarl, whoever that might be. All right, so it looks like this is a strike. Let's go check the inn. Oh yeah, you can raise your destruction if you stand on top of fires. Fun fact. Oh, the Falkreath, like, look how he sits, too. Like, yeah, the Falkreath dude is a bit on the creep side. Uh, probably not the barracks. I wonder if it's in here. Oh, Nate, that lady, that uh, Arcadia, that lives in Whiterun, she sent a hit out on me because she found someone I stole new? all her shit. Perhaps someone looking for me to mix something up for them? Well, my family back in Hammerfell didn't approve of my interest in lethal poisons and death in general, so I left. You thought it was Garl, not north. Jarl. When I found Haven't this you watched town, me play this game for like cemetery, three months? I felt right at home. I opened the shop, and I've never looked back. This is where I belong. Uh, I know, but what you must... That's why the inn is called Dead Man's Drink. Yeah, this the ain't, uh, this ain't going anywhere. Farm and nope. so on. I suppose. Corpse Light Farm? That's a cool name. Alright, I'm going to do a teeny tiny bit of cheating. Uh, Skyrim. No, I'm looking up uh, Skyrim. Alright. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. I would like to know how to begin this quest, please. Uh oh. Nah, we'll find it. We're good at this. I can make it. I made it this. It looks like someone put a hit on me. I mean, how expensive? How expensive would a hit on? Like a regular person, like me or you, be. Like it can't be that much. I'd be really easy to like. Murder. <laughs> Dead man's drink sounds like a place that you can get a quest. And if I can't find it here, I'll look it up one more time. If I can't find, nah, it's got. No, look at this guy. This guy, this guy looks like he has a quest. Look oh, at him. Did you need something? Oh, he's the bard. Sure. What can I do for you? Only true imperials request that one. Oh, I can make a request and then he doesn't charge me money. Days come and gone. Uh, Thad gear? Are you a are you a quest giver? That's why that, that's why you need like in uh some like RPGs and stuff you need the little like beacon above their head, little exclamation mark or question mark. Unless someone, this isn't the place you're looking for, traveler. I buried lots of people for its graveyard, traveler. We've buried more dead than you can imagine. I just finished giving my Yeah, I don't think it'd be that hard to find someone to like proper burial might by probably fire. get away with it too. Old Hardhead hated the idea of being lost cold in the ground. All they have to Could do you is send me like the, to Runil, the priest of Arcade. I'll tell I'll tell you later. You know the right blessing. <laughs> it's a funny one. Buried soul. Thank you. All right then. Uh, I don't think this is the quest. No, it's a miscellaneous quest. We don't do those. If they don't have a quest name, we ain't doing them. All right, uh, Mary. Drink will chase off that chill in the air. Oh, Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. Big talk of a little boy in Windhelm. Name of Aventus Aretino. 
Oh, Get this. He's been that's trying a to good cook. rumor to of have. Of course. It's all in this note. Alright. Brownie for crows, dude. You hear any juicy gossip in town? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, this one is how you start the Dark Brotherhood quest date. Uh, you go to... It starts out as a miscellaneous quest, but it's talk to Aventus Aretino in uh, Whiterun, or you can just go murder someone and then sleep. All right. Bones for a crow. Bandits have long been a source of angst for the people of Skyrim. I spoke with an innkeeper who received a bounty. Uh, excuse me, this is a generic sure quest. This is the right me. one. I've half a mind to ask if you'll take me on one of your adventures, but I can't just leave Varga right. on her own. Oh. Oh. Do those little feet stink? Wait, Strangers hurry Strangers like you Dust? bring war. I've seen enough war. I'm a Nord. I live here. All right, so that one was a bust. What else is in this town? There's the graveyard. These graves. Ah, uh, I mean, it's the biggest graveyard. <laughs> All right, Lod's gonna just want to talk about that horse. Um. Shit. All right, we're almost running out of places. Try the traders. And they try the graveyard. A hearty Man, put those boobies away. Don't, she can dress however All she wants. You'll find my brother Solof and I are the only true Nords in Falkreath. <laughs> Not that one. Let's do a little bit of cheating. There we go. What the hell is this? It's like a list of all the items. I don't want that. I want the... Just tell me how to start. Alright, so how do I... Uh, how do I begin? How do I... Do Oh my goodness, Gabe, I, I would just like to... I would just like to begin this quest. That's all. I just want to start it. Just tell me how to begin it. Oh man. How is this so complicated? I just want to begin a quest. I want to begin a quest and play it with my friends. The god. You. Who's this responsible for the cemetery? I have a delivery. Ah, oh, Barret's sure. ashes. Oh man, he this guy looks like man. he's already dead. Not many warriors grow to a fine old age. Thank you for bringing this to me. I'll make sure he gets his rights. Here, for your trouble. Don't give me money. No. I am. I came into Arcade. I'm for. Could you do an old elf a favor? I misplaced my journal in a cave I was exploring. I'll pay for its return. Blessing of Arcade to you for your help. Boss Mother Cavern. I can't. Do oh, that. what about this? Coost is my assistant. He helps me tend the. But he All right. My husband was fine. Uh, a to sad fall. time. But we might better understand the Our daughter Who died. Our little girl. Our, oh my god. She hadn't seen her tenth winter. She was. Uh, he ripped her apart. Like a saber cat tears oh, a deer. Oh, this is how you begin a we different quest. Um, hold on. We have too much money on our hands. Alright, so. We can't use these unless we have money. We're not supposed to have money. So let's. I can't just drop gold? Uh, do I have to find a container? How do I be without you? 
Not a little share action. Denigir sus? You lost. He did have a very elfy voice. Skyrim has a like a lack of voice act <laughs> actors. All right, so this guy gave us money that we can't have. So goodbye. Hey, next time you look inside that barrel, I think you're gonna be happy. I'm Where sorry. You? I should really go now. Uh, I mean, isn't this your house? Do, would you like me to go? Well, shoot. No, you're okay. All right. Well, it looks like we're running our asses to uh, the White Run to go to Dragon Reach. I mostly deal with petty thievery. All right, hold on. They're trying to. Wait, now what quest do I have? Oh, that journal. I can't. That microphone smells like a little kid foot. I don't think this one. I think that's. Yeah, it's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Drunken. Read the bounty for Crow's Tooth. Oh, Crow's Tooth. Uh, let's try this bounty. Bounty. Knife uh, Point Ridge. That's not the one. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Nope, not that one. Oh, literally it's called Bounty for Crow's Tooth. Wish you had a horse now, don't you? Never. No, I don't. I don't, I don't need a horse. All right, bounty. Rumor has it that Forsworn raiding parties have been pushing further and further east along the Jeral Mountains. The arrival of Legate Fassendil has prevented further incursions, but they failed to apprehend their leader, Crowstooth. While Crowstooth has been separated from her forces, she is believed to have fled with considerable spoils. In an effort to put an end to this threat, anyone killing Crow's Tooth may claim her stolen loot. Mercenaries like famous cell sword Bjormung Wingstrider have been seen heading into the mountains beyond Darklight Tower. While they could be after the treasure, it is feared Crow's Tooth is gathering these forces for a renewed assault. We ask any capable warriors for their aid in dealing with this potential threat. Oh, I mean, like, that's probably a good quest as any that we're going to get now, right? How far away is it? Oh, no. Oh, are you for real? All right, so we're going to put put this one on the back burner. And we're going to just head to uh, Dragon's Reach. And next time we're on that side of the mountains, we'll uh, we'll do that one. Am I facing the right way? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, well, uh... We can't fast travel, we can't spend money on a carriage, so that would be us running the entire way. So we might as well just do that when we're on that side of the mountains again. I know that there's an, an extra quest in a white run. Or, uh, Windhelm, rather. There's one at the Mage's Cult. Pledge. You guys aren't going to attack me, right? You're just cool people. Be warned. No, they're not. I haven't done that quest. There are no dragons about. <laughs> Uh, this is uh, one of our quests is to kill these people, but we're busy. Over here. We're just going to ignore them, keep going. We'll do a little bit of dodging and weaving. See if we get shot in the back of the head. A little ducking and diving and dipping and rolling. I wish you had a horse. Of course, of course. I do have a horse. I have a, I have like a metal dwarven horse. Of course. Ah, uh, wait. Oh, oh. That. I think that elf just took an arrow for me. Oh, and these guys are just the hunters, right? Yeah. They can, they can live. And we are peckish, of course. Ah, uh, it's. Seared Slaughterfish. I should have, uh... I should have kept that one, because that one weighs the least. Also... I guess I really don't need to do this, but I really want to go grab the Golden Claw to put it in my house. Wait, am I going towards Helgen? Yeah, I don't want to go towards Helgen. What's that? Okay. 
place he wants a chimichanga. I'm just, I'm just happy with our armor. Like this, this is so cool. I'm glad that uh, we did that quest. Oh, I know where we're at. Down here, and then to the down here. And we can run so far. <laughs> and we don't need a horse because we are a horse, basically. Oh, we look so cool. What is it called? Spell Knight armor? Spell Knight? Yeah, Spell Knight. Oh, I don't have enough for this. I wanted to make myself into a... Strangulation? Am I Darth Vader? Oh, did you learn your lesson there, puppy? We're at Riverwood. Everybody's first, like, favorite little city to begin in. A dragon. I saw a dragon. I don't think there's any new quests to start here. So that's why we're just passing on through. You know what can run further? A horse. Ah, -uh, man. I can run out front any horse. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's, like, you're absolutely right, and I should use my horse to, like, ride around on. Especially since I have it, it's not doing anything. But it's just, like, the controls are so wonky. And I guess that's more on me than anything, but... Yeah, I just, I just like running around. I'm still kind of used to it. Like, because, like, yeah, you would just, like, have to fight, and then get back on, and then go into, into different places. So I think I just got into the habit of not having a horse. But that doesn't mean I should maintain that habit of not having a horse. Alright. Here's the city. And then I think we have to go to Dragon Reach itself. And this quest should be called... This creature is definitely called... Or this creature, this quest is uh, called In the Shadows. Yeah, thanks for everyone for uh, popping in, by the way. I do appreciate you watching and hanging out. can't level up your stamina by running. Uh, in the old games, you could level up your stamina by running and jumping. So literally, you just have people that are running around doing this in like Morrowind and Oblivion and stuff. Just always. But it, yeah, well like, it, it's really like not very immersive either to just go around and be doing that. And so I think they changed it a little bit to because of that too. Jimmy Changa. Oh, I'm sorry. You want like Tums or something? Alright, so Dragon's Reach. 
Oh yeah, sorry, hun. I'll I'll finish it off for you. That's what being married is for. Finish each finish in each other's drinks. Olfred, patron of the great clan Battleborn. <laughs> Change it by requiring you to buy a horse. Yeah, well, like... Oh, no, they did have horses in Oblivion. I was gonna say, like, you get a, uh... You get a unicorn mount. But then I think if you got off it, it would, like, return back to its, like, little forest. All right. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me, I prefer my books and my spells. I just gotta make sure. All right, no books to read. No, oh, no, that's not it. Nah, it's not gonna be one on here, is it? I probably have to talk to the Jarl, huh? He's gonna be like, hey, do you want to do a quest for me? So, you were uh, a Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? I haven't done this. Really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute. Especially now. What I want to know is... Hmm, I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this... Oh, this wine's this. from our wedding? Yeah. Ah, okay. What do you say now, Proventus? Alright, so we'll we talk to him. To trust in the we'll see of if... Our walls after, you know, th this is basically my first time Lord. meeting him. We should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... Riverwood has like four buildings, it's fine. You'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should not... I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my young. Huh? If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. Excuse me. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. I have. Here, take Ever. this as a small Steel token plate of my armor speed. added. There is another. Come. Oh, let's Bleak Falls go find Faringar. My court Yeah, wizard. let's go find Faringar. Looking into a matter related. What's old Faringar up to? Uh, and then while we're doing that, we take. Y the Jarl's gift, <laughs> and you throw and you hide it. There we go. We don't need that. There's a tranquility in magic, better. don't you think? It is simply energy to be harnessed by those with the will and knowledge to do so. Oh, man, I don't know. I don't know. Is it ain't my thing? I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Did I write down how it starts? Nope. Why, Woody? I mean, it's not like there's that many people to talk to here. Somebody's got to give me a quest. <laughs> Maybe they'll give me a quest like... I wonder if I do have to, like, do this first. Bring back this tablet. So the old thinks you wants. can be of use to me. All right. All oh, yes, right. You must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch... I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Yeah. Straight to the point. I uh, learned of a... Go to Bleak Falls Barrow. I think this, this is like tablet, the first time no I've ever done this chamber, and then not and it already me. had the itself. tablet. Sadly, no. Have you Perhaps I'm, what a fascinating conversation that would be. This Off is a priority. May the gods watch over right. your battles, friend. All these are all standard. Um, let's wait till... Let's wait till day. Yeah, that's like the very first quest. It's like baby's first, baby's first quest from like... Um... Oh, are we hungry? Oh, we're starving! Oh, let's do that one first.
Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. That's easy. Uh, we just need to talk to Mr. the guy that we buy the houses from, Preventius, uh, Artentius. Quintentius. Florentius. All right, so you're sitting there. I, Where's your? Oh, there he is. is, as you can imagine, very busy. Oh, so yeah, so Nate, you. this is the one outside the city. So there's a, there's a house inside the city, and that's worth five grand. But it's really, it's like a, it's like baby's first house. Like it's good for the early game, but you don't want it. This is the the homestead outside the house. If you can afford it, this one's a good one. Of course, it's all in this note. Uh, the fire pit in the middle house is the I'll is the one that's right now. the shitty house. Father Promise. All you ever do is complain yes. about what you want. You're a spoiled baby. I'm going to tell Father you said that. He'll tan your hide for sure. I want to just like Fus Rodam. All right, they done. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, oh my god, what is it, this one even called? Steward's Note. Alright, <clears throat> Bertha. It's like literally addressed to me? I apologize for the secrecy, but I'd rather not speak about this in front of the Jarl. In the event that uh, the information I received is incredible, he has enough on his plate as it is. Eh, I don't know if I believe that. You see, earlier last week I received a tip from an unnamed source regarding a potential assassination plot on the Jarl. And you just happen to think, like, he's not going to want to have anything to do with this. It's an assassination plot on him, but he's got a lot on his plate right now. Now, while we <laughs> take all threats seriously, uh, it doesn't sound like you do. It's difficult to know just how credible this source is. And with everything that's happened of late, I don't have time to investigate this myself. That's why I'd like you to head to Arcadia's Cauldron and check their ledger for any serious purchases. Oh, suspicious purchases, sorry. In particular, poisons. I've asked Arcadia to leave you a copy of her on her counter, look over it, find out who purchased bottles over the last few days, and confirm their reasons are legitimate. In the meantime, I'll have our cooks check every piece of food, bottle of mead, leftover breadcrumb just to be sure nothing is tainted. If your investigation turns anything uh, turns up anything, then I'll know the information I received is false. Oh, jeez, I need to learn how to read someday. If your investigation turns up nothing, then I'll know your, the information I received is false, and the Jarl is safe for the time being. If not, I hope someone uh, of your reputation can take care of the situation swiftly. So, assassination on the Jarl. There it is, in the shadows. We're doing this one. Uh, okay, so we're super tired. I oh, I don't know if there's anywhere to sleep around here. One of the new servants? Remember that I like my meat. Right? Oh, I've got camping supplies. I'll be all right. Are you Bertha? Yeah, I'm broke. Uh, yeah, I broke Bertha. Absurd that you can't get good sweet rolls. For the no the money challenge. Hole what? Of a city. What'd you just call me? All right, we can't. I'm, I'm pretty sure we don't sleep anywhere inside the city. But where are we supposed? To, oh, Ar Arcadia's called. Wait, what? I'm on the right one. Yeah, why is it telling me to go to the wrong, to the wrong place? All right. I don't think so. You are tired. I know I'm tired. But I uh, know it's from not sleeping. Also, fun fact, uh, I stole a bunch of stuff from this lady when we had all of our diseases. <laughs> and so she has sent a bunch of hired goons after me to kill me. <laughs> I was wondering why so many random letters said Bertha. Yeah, man, they're really obsessed with this woman. Yeah, see how she has like nothing? She figured out that that was me, and then sent some goons after me. I stole so much. I stole almost everything that she had. No, I killed them all. <laughs> they came to they came to kill me, and I killed them instead. It's a circle of life. Would you guys, instead of keeping on and going on with this, would you rather read the notes on on uh, my tamed rabbit? Thistle. Oh, thistle. Ah, oh, Jesus, all right. Um, business ledger copy. There it is. <laughs> Check the stables. Investigate the Hall of the Dead. Anywho. 
Yeah, we're not reading that. But we need to sleep. Also, Brit says, there's a small bandit camp right outside, and it has a bed. Also, Brit says, hi, tired, I'm dead. Because I kept saying, oh, man, I'm tired. So she goes, hi, tired, I'm dead. Because she's saying it as me. It's layers of jokes. <laughs> layers on top of layers of jokes. Hi, Brit. Thank you for watching me. Or listening to me. One of those two. Yeah, skip the ads for the baby. Or else she won't watch. She, she doesn't watch no ads. Especially for health insurance. Perfect. Uh, yeah, there is a bandit camp right outside of here. I think there's a little house. Oh yeah, I have like, yeah, I have camping supplies, but I don't want to use them up. I think they're like a one-time use. Yeah, you, t you, every time you go camping, when you're done, you throw away your tent, you throw away your sleeping bag, you throw away everything away afterwards. Everyone knows that. You throw everything away <laughs> when you're done after the first time. Oh yeah, and if you're ever, anybody's wondering at this point why I am not staying at the inn, it's a no money challenge. We can't pay to sleep at an inn. We have to find a spot. Lacey said, show the people you have no money. There's my no money. I have not spent a single dime in this place. Out of my way, asshole, I'm sleeping here now. <laughs> um, good enough. Oh wait, one more. We'll do one more. We can't recover all the way because we're sleeping outside. Need but I mean, it's 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 good enough. Yeah. Hey, what's outside? Oh, the See stable. See, store. Literally works out perfect. We'll go check the stable. We'll go inside and check. So uh, we're checking to see why these people bought poison or ingredients to make poison. So the first one at the stable is going to be like, yo, why'd you buy all this poison? They're like, oh, I need to get rid of one of my horses. <sighs> you know that old trick, the old poison poison apple. There's a Kaji tent. Alright, the stable's right over here. We'll pop in here, interrogate him a little bit, like, yo, why you buy poison? Who you, who you planning on killing? The Jarl? And they'll be like, no. Just in case my uh, detective skills go a little sideways, let's save. What? What is this? Uh. Sir? Lunar steel. Alright, we don't have lunar steel yet, so let's grab that. And you. Oh my god, there's always notes. Alright, first of all. Tech life. Uh, stable hands note. <laughs> Alright, I gotta wait until this stuff, uh... <laughs> Alright. Uh, the Dark Elf was smart to choose me. Scars aside, I can pass as a stable boy easily enough. I'll tell a shopkeep I got bucked by a wild one and landed face first into, into the briars. Uh, I'm smart like that. The other bandits always poke fun at my face, saying I look like a newborn babe, but it comes in handy for jobs like this. Uh, after seeing how well the Dark Elf pays, the entire gang will be looking for a razor pretty soon. Speaking of which, I'm supposed to meet my mysterious benefactor back at the stables and not at the Silent Moon's camp. Not sure why, but he says if I'm followed, it's best I stay in character until I'm well clear of the city gates. Well, I hope he doesn't sneak up on me while I wait. I nearly shit myself the last time. But smart guy that I am, I bought this tome to help me find him. Thing is, I opened it up and can't for the life of me figure out how it works. Only a matter of time, though, for a guy like me. Oh, so that's his detect life. He's like, oh, so I don't want to get stuck up on it anymore and poop my pants. 
So I'm going to learn how to detect life. Alright, so Silent Moon's camp. Okay, so we don't need to go check out the other thing. Because we figured out that the person that hired him... So he's like a bandit. And he got hired to go... Do something for someone. And this person that hired him is at the Silent Moon's camp. So that's where we're going to go check out. Every time I look over to check my chat, just to make sure I didn't miss anything, it was just the last joke of, hey, tired, I'm dead, that I get to look at and enjoy every time. <laughs> and you mind grabbing one more of those for me before I'm done? I need something to, I need something to wash down this wine. Mm. Ah, delicious. Love it, it's from our wedding. A Coors Light, please. I guess that's all we got. If we had real beers, I'd take one of those. But... Nah, that's too late for caffeine. I'm an old man now. I can't have caffeine this late at night. I'm an old man with old bones. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, man. Alright, before we get this fight kicked out. I'm going to pee real quick. I'll be right back, y'all. You know the drill. You know the drill. Face is on. Be your correct. Alright, let's go. Silent Moon's camp. Oh, yeah, the lunar thing that we got, if you're wondering. Uh, while the moons are out, because multiple moons, burn the target for 20 points. Yeah, I'm. Yeah, sorry, homie. Oh yeah, we are missing a bunch of our stuff that gives us uh to die. that gives us more two-handed damage. <laughs> but that doesn't stop us from smashing people in the ribs. Right. Couple more up here. Still looking good though. Oh my god. I'm chilly because I'm getting hit with icicles. There we go. There we go. I don't want any of that. What the hell is this? Oh, bye. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for the help, man. Really appreciate it. Jerk. Uh, chug that beer. Take the lockpick. Right, oh, it doesn't want us to go in that way. Alright. So we're meeting up so with someone here. Or somebody that is buying poison to maybe kill the guy. Oh my god. They need to, uh... tone it back a bit on the peckish. We got 
Ebony arrows? Wish I could. Ah, well. Assassin's Journal. <laughs> uh, how long is this? Eh, it's not, that's not bad. We got this. We got this. <laughs> the bow has uh, long been a player in the game. It's toppled many a piece from Jarls the Kings. It does... Okay. There will come a time when he sits idly by his grand hall, unbothered by the world. In that moment, when the Jarl has a chance to finally breathe, I will sneak my way into the upper floors and make sure that his breath is his last. When I take my leave cloaked in her shadow, all anyone will hear is a rattle. Death's rattle. So we take that. It's all iron. These are ebony? I mean, we're not big arrow people, but those are just cool. Alright, what else we got? Light armor foraging. Already read it. Uh, on the lunar. Notes on the lunar forge. So I think it has to be nice for, like, all that stuff to actually work. Staff of perilous paths. Lay down a spike barrier. Nah. That's all good. All right, that's all good. I think there's a bed right around the corner. Yeah, there's one right here. Sleep for an hour. We save. We didn't get all the way rested because we're outside and we don't like own the bed. Right? I slept outside so many times. All right. Oh, beautiful day in Skyrim, though. Yeah, everybody, let's uh, let's take a moment to appreciate. A little, it's a little foggy, a little misty. Alright, where are we going? Literally just back to Dragon's Reach. Alright. Oh, we got like 10 minutes. We can make it. Yeah, then I'll look up how to, uh, I'll look up how to do bit the quest from Falkreath to make sure I've got the right area written down. I wrote down, uh, the new quest's, like, name and where they began. And if it was in a weird spot in the city, I would write like, oh, it's in the inn. But in that one, I didn't write that like, it was anywhere like weird. So yeah. So I'm either not as uh, clever as I think, or I might've wrote down the wrong spot. Either way, brilliant on my part. A da 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 da. The da 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 da. <sighs> yeah, little one's been uh, babbling a lot lately. Our uh, favorite thing to say is just like a long stream of ba ba and da da. Just like. Brrr. Jump. Little jump. What else was a good one? The uh, last time we did the uh, the Twin Souls or what? What's that one called? That was a good one. The Souls Divided. Uh, that quest. That that was in Riften, and that was a really good one. If you guys haven't seen like the Souls Divided, like go uh, go do that quest. That one's a really good one. That's in Riften, and all you have to do is go to the Ratway. You don't have to, have to do anything else special. <laughs> Uh, that, and that's a stall rim armor. That is ice that's as hard as rock. Alright, up to Dra oh, I'm tired. Up to Dragon's Reach. Where apparently somebody's just gonna be hiding on like the balcony. Hungry for apples? Are the moons out? We are but nine. Oh man, that guy is so intense.
Hey, thanks everyone for being here, by the way. I know it's pretty much almost past my bedtime. Oh, it's like up there on the balcony, yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Wait, so literally, did this guy just like sneak in here? Like, I think I can see him. Oh, maybe not. Okay, okay. All right. This guy doesn't. Oh, like he doesn't sit as stupid as the like Jarl in Falkreath. Though the Jarl in Falkreath is like melting into his chair. <laughs> All right, so here I am. Ha, found you. Oh yeah, shit! You huh? <laughs> oh, because I was. <laughs> Just getting jumpy, I guess. <laughs> How did I cut his head off? The bow of shadows. Take those. Take that. Take that. Oh, what? That's so good. Weapon draw is twenty percent faster. Cool. And casts invisibility for thirty seconds. That's so cool. Like a free invisibility. Invisibility every time you just draw this. Yeah! That's busted! I serve Jarl Balgruff as steward. I found the assassin and took Excellent. care of him. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Oh, I don't want 750 your bucks. Dragon's reach. Oh, you ass. Um. Uh. Uh, I think it's in there still. There we go. I mean, that bow is super cool. Like, we don't use bows. But if we had a, if we had a character, like... In these halls, except in the yard. Like, our last character was a stealth... Or, like, it was a bit of a stealth archer. But, uh, we weren't doing, like, the no money challenge, so I swapped over. Like, that would be so good. <laughs> Being able to be invisible every time. It's so good. Draws faster. That's like convenience. <laughs> huh? Right on, though. I think the last, one of the last new quests I have is up in Winterhold. And we've got a little time before I call it for the night. So let's start running that way and see how far we make it. And then when we pick up on Wednesday, not tomorrow. Uh, we're doing three days this week, you guys. So I'll be here Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And I'll put, I have the schedule on Twitch too. I'll, I'll try to do, do a good job making sure that stays updated. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, Tuesday, Thursday, just kind of, like, we're just kind of getting, like, a feel for it. But also, uh, gives me a chance to play a little bit of League of Legends with my buddy. Is it a little girl? Sitting up in her crib? Oh, that's... Did she sit herself up? Aw, little one. That's so good. She just sat up on her own. Man, that means we have to start, like, kid-proofing a lot more shit. Now she can, like, potentially pull herself, like, over things. So we gotta make sure it's, like, not tall enough for her to, like, look over the edge of shit. Oh my god, being a parent. It's like looking after a drunk, but they, like, never sober up. <laughs> just wake up in the morning, they're just, like, still belligerent. <laughs> Oh, but it, yeah, Nate. So do you, uh, yeah, we should play a little league tomorrow. Only if you want. To. Still into that kind of stuff. Yeah. And so Nate, this is the house I was talking about. This is the one that's uh, seven and a half grand. They could charge like, it, like it's worth like thirty. I don't. I mean, I don't know. But like, I would definitely pay more for it than that. I 
I think I left a bunch of shit here too. Because I thought I could, uh, I thought I could earn this house by killing someone. <laughs> so I started putting shit here, I believe. Yeah, look at it all. I mean, would I drop like four pounds, if that? Ah. Son of a biscuit. Yeah, so one of the fun things about never being able to fast travel or uh, spend money is that it forces you to actually have to... Uh, Use the map. Oh yeah, I don't know how many of y'all are making it like this far in the... Uh, oh man, I'm out of control. Why? It's too late now. I think I like a rat. Oh yeah, if uh, anybody makes it this far, if you guys happen to play any league or anything, uh, I almost, I like 99.9 .9 of the time, 99% of the time, I'm just playing ARAM with A. But if you guys ever, uh, if you guys play League and p like playing some ARAM, we're very like, we're very, ch I mean, if you've watched me, you know, like, we're very chill, very low key. Like, we take our games seriously enough, but like, we're not gonna like, get on people for making mistakes or like, trying a different build or anything like that. Like, if you're being shitty or if you like, leave, like, shitty to other people, or, like, I don't know, people like, like, oh, what the bill? Like, I don't care. But if they're, like, someone else, or if they're, like, you know, using slurs and shit, I'm not about that, but, uh, but yeah, it's just, like, a lot of for fun games. If you guys ever want to, like, pop in, join up with Nate and I, just, uh, yeah, nick a time 084. I didn't get that <laughs> creative with it. And we'd be happy to have you. Oh, I should probably say we're not very good either. Like, that's why we're playing ARAM. <laughs> Chili can't. Oh, but there's a uh, place up here to warm up. Yeah, I was trying to get a. I was trying to get a little League of Legends uh, for you guys too on the channel, but I can't. I gotta uh, figure out uh, the like sound quality when I was playing when I uh, was really bad for voice chat and I didn't want to like have you guys deal with that so I've got to figure something else out. What is there no beds? Oh they're probably up here. And by probably up here I mean definitely not up here. There's one. further. Got a couple of minutes. Yeah, and I'll try to, uh, I'll try to accept, like, all your friend requests and shit like that. Uh, every now, like, every now and then, like, you, you know, you get people, like, especially if you played League, you know, like, people, like, after a match, and if, like, you know, they want to, like, some people will, like friend you just to talk shit to you, and that happens sometimes with me. But I'll try to uh, accept everyone's friend request. But if for some reason it doesn't get accepted within a couple days, just like reach out to me. You can mess. You guys can message me on uh, YouTube. You can message me on. Like you guys uh, can put it down in the comments. You can on here. You can give me a whisper. I'm on Discord too. I still gotta put a little link out for that. Yeah, yeah, feel free. You guys can always like reach out. Just like say hi. Tell me something you like. Tell me something you think I could do a little better. I mean, that'll go on forever, but you know what I mean. Um, think I'll survive this?
Ah, uh, easy. Abandoned prison discovered. All right, I'm uh, I'm curious. Uh, I'll stop it right here for everyone. It's eight past my bedtime. Uh, but yeah, thanks everyone for popping in. New schedule. We'll be uh, figuring it out, but it's gonna be something along these lines. I'll be streaming more in the like evenings, uh, maybe every now and then on the weekend. But my weekends honestly are pretty packed. Uh, but yeah, thanks everyone. A uh, little bit of a change, but it is what it is. But I appreciate you guys. Yeah, hit me up, reach out, let me know. Anyway, anybody wants to play some League, Nate and I are always ready. And then other than that, yeah, and make sure to go check out his channel too. He's uh, always uh, watching me and keeping me safe from the bots. But yeah, go check out Look It's Cakes. And yeah, you have a good one. I'll catch you all Wednesday.